Hello, my name is Stephen Woodall. I am the Systems Administrator and Webmaster here at Reliant Business Products in Houston, Texas. Uh, today I'd like to talk to you about Reliant's online ordering system, specifically the approval functionality of it. Um, what you see here before you is an email where a user submitted an order for approval and within that email you'll be able to see a bunch of detail like the order information, um, the order date, account number, department, and so on, uh, who submitted that order, the bill to and shipping addresses, and if we scroll down within that email, you'll be able to see the line item detail, the quantity, price, extended quantity, the subtotal, any um, delivery instructions or order notes that the user might have uh, entered into the order prior to the approval process. And what I need to do now is you'll notice here in the top of the email is a little link that says you may click here to go directly to the order. As the approver, I'm going to want to click there and go directly to the order. And when I do, what's going to happen is that a web browser will open up and it will take me to the Reliant Business Products website where I can log in with my user ID and password. So what I'm going to do next is go ahead and click on the login button here. And what this will do is it will log me into Reliant's website. The very next screen I see on there is once again a copy of that order that I was just looking at within my email. You're going to see that there's the order status, uh, there's the order summary. You can scroll down and you can see where you can change the um, uh, what is it, the um, uh, requisition number, a uh, PO number. Uh, you can add order notes, delivery instructions. Uh, you can even come over here and change the payment method if you desire to do that. Uh, further on down, what you will see is a list of items, which were also displayed within that email we were looking at earlier. If everything looks good on this, and I want to process the order without any further action, what I do is scroll to the bottom, and you'll notice down here at the bottom of the web page is Approve Order. Just click on the Approve Order button, you'll see it says Please Wait, and if I zoom out, you're actually going to see where the order was processed for approval. As you notice, I did not have to do anything special. I didn't have to uh, verify or approve and deny each individual line item. I just simply scrolled down to the bottom of the screen, hit approve order, and I am done. So now I can go ahead and if you want to for security purposes, right below Reliance logo is a logout button. Go ahead and click on logout and proceed about your day. I do appreciate you for taking the time to watch this tutorial and if you have any questions, please feel free to give me a call or Reliance customer service staff a call at 713-980-7105. That customer service number again is 713-980-7105. And I thank you very much for your business and for your time.